welcome back welcome back welcome back hey guys thanks for joining me today today I will be bringing you guys a empties video so yes guys I'm showing you the products I'm buying the products I want to be able to show you the pro that I'm using the products as well and so let's see what we have here that I emptied this is over a course of two months, um, June, July, and a couple of weeks here in August. Um, it's, these are the empties from. I started a new bag um, Saturday, so I want to take out the trash. So, yeah, we're going to take out the trash today, guys. Um, I used Aloha Kiwi and Passion Fruit. And in this um, is Tropical Passion Fruit, Radiant Kiwi, and Juicy Pineapple. So yeah, I really liked it. this one, you guys. I don't know if this is the lid that I got with it, but I don't know. Um, it did burn nicely and even around. Don't mind that sooting there. That's from me trying to light it when it got so low. But yeah, anyway, um, this did... Um, Pulled very well. It fragranced my whole house. Um, I could smell it from the living room upstairs. So it it had a real nice. It was pretty strong. It was a real nice scent, and I really enjoyed it. And yes, I will purchase this. I really like the scent of this, and it's just a nice sweet scent. So yes, I enjoyed this. So I will purchase this one again. So that's that. Then I went through two Yankee Candle Room Sprays. June and July. I went through the Macintosh, which smelled like apples. Had a real nice scent. Now these are concentrated, so one to two sprays of this will scent the room out. It's very strong. I wouldn't do no more than maybe two sprays. Depended upon the space of the room, but I think that two sprays is enough for any size room to me. Um, and then I went through white strawberry Bellini. And that smelled just like strawberries. I love these room sprays by um, Yankee Candle and by uh, Bath and Body Works. But since I can get to a Yankee Candle outlet quicker than I can a Bath and Body Works because... A Bath and Body Works outlet is just far, far from me. And to get in here and get in these for like at a reasonable price, $2 and some change, is worth the drive to the my nearest Yankee outlet. So I really like these. So I got the, I'm out of those. I'm using a couple of more, but those are by Bath and Body Works. But anyway, um, I went through a Lavender Marshmallow. And the scent notes in this is lavender, vanilla marshmallow, and warm amber. And yes, it did have a nice um, vanilla smell to it, to me. Um, I could smell lavender, but it was light. But yeah, I will purchase this again. I really like this one. I like this one. And then I like this one too as well. The banana flower. I thought I went through. Yeah. I like this one too so I went through two of them and in this is fresh banana puree vanilla bean and jasmine and I oh my god the banana and the jasmine with the vanilla bean mixed together in the liquid soap foam this is a nice scent I really enjoyed this and yes I will purchase some more of this if they come out with them next year I don't know if they out now I don't think so. You might can find it at your nearest outlet, but yeah, I will purchase that again. Um, I also went through Fiji White Sands, and this is White Sands, Vanilla Orchid, and Warm Amber. So, this was a real pretty scent. Let me smell it again. Oh, yeah, it just smelled like, it just was a real nice, um, just more like a gave me a beach vibe 
um, it was like an aquatic type scent. It had that real soft note in there. Yeah, that vanilla. But the vanilla don't stand out. But it is a nice fragrance. So yeah, I like that. And of course, I went through Black Cherry Malo, and I like this as well. This is Dark Cherry, Black Raspberry, and Malo. So yeah, I like this. I really like this here. Cherries. So that's an empty. I don't know. Um, I'm digging in this bag, guys. I went through a butterfly flower. This is an old one I had to finish. Um, and this just smells like a, a bed of flowers, and the scents just come together and make this scent in the summertime. Like if you walk it through a different variety of flowers, and the scents that they give will make this scent here. That's what it smells like to me. It's, it has a floral note to it. And see, I was, I'm trying to get all of it out before I... But it's an empties, but I had it sitting upside down like this. So I could get the residue off the sides of the bottle. So it's still a tad bit more now. I want to try to get out. But I went through that. Butterfly flower. So yeah. I'm trying to get the rest of that out guys. So I went through that. And then I went through a course of kitchen lemon. This was in my kitchen. It smells like lemon. I like to keep the citrus scents in the kitchen. So, yes, I went through the kitchen lemon. I will purchase this. I think I, yeah, got one in there now. So, yeah, I went through that. Um, I have to throw this away. Um, the peach and, peach and sweet tea. I didn't go through all of the guys. It's Georgia peach, sweet tea, white nectar, apple blossom, and jasmine petals. I didn't go through it because... It is a it's old 2016 so I mean the cream it didn't change but it it sound like it got like a liquid too I don't know if y'all can hear it but it it um broke down so this is no good it went bad on me guys before I could even finish it when I was looking through my stash and I seen I always try to look through to make sure I don't overlook nothing and try to use the creams that's older from the new creams that I recently buy but I tried to put the old in the front and the new in the back so I guess this got mixed up and because I think I have uh, a Georgia peach and sweet tea I think my daughter has one I don't know but this got mixed up guys and it went bad on me so I had about this much left of it from here down. So this is trash. That's that's I gotta throw that away. It's it's not no good. Um I went through a single wick candle, um, honeysuckle, and in this is uh honeysuckle, let's see. I don't know. Where the notes say? It just say honeysuckle. Oh, here we go. Honeysuckle, nectar, peony petals, and vanilla. Oh, it smells really good. It had a nice pull to it. You can see, guys, it did burn evenly around here. And so, I really enjoyed it. The honeysuckle. I just really like it. it just, um... It just screams summer to me, guys. So, yeah, honeysuckle. I went through this candle. I also went through Rainforest Gardenia. And um, in this is uh, Gardenia, Apple Water, and um, White Woods. Oh, it smells really nice. It has a nice, clean, fresh scent to it. And so I was burning this at the same time. I was burning this one to, in the same two different areas, but they was burning at the same time. So, yeah, and they mix very well together. So yeah, I will get these again single wick. Um, I also went through two of the 
Wallflowers, Tiki Beach. I went through that. And then this is Vanilla Orchid, Vanilla Musk Orchid, and Orchids, and Toasted Coconut. And yeah, you can smell the coconut in that. So that was a nice scent. And I don't know what this one was. But it smelled like it was a nice sweet scent like a peach scent. This probably was a peach scent here. Because I have them plugged up all through the house. And I try to keep the tags on it. Just like I do, did with this one. I try to keep the tags on it so I can keep up with what I'm using. So this one I'm using now, which I love. And um, it's dark cherry, black raspberry, and sumptuous merlot. So I'm using black cherry now. And see, it's almost gone. But I, I really like the scent of this one here. That's, that's pulling a real nice scent into the air. Um, this is a candle that's not from Bath and Body Works. This is a... Uh, I just threw this in there. This is from Dollar General, guys. It's Sparkle Apple and Pear. And this candle here was uh, $5. I thought I'd give it a try. And... It has a nice scent, surprisingly, to me. Sparkling apple and pear. You would think, like in a Dollar General store, they won't um, have nice scents. But I went back and got a few more of these candles, and I will show you guys. But if you are a person who doesn't like these strong scents that Bath & Body Works carry, you know they scents are very strong. And some of their scents can be nauseating or headache-inducing. And it's like, oh my God, it's just so overwhelming. It's so powerful. And you want something that you can smell and it pulls nicely and has a light sense. You know something is um, sitting, scenting the space, but it's um, very, it's not light, but you can smell it. This candle um, scented my living room in a nice light scent. It wasn't like wham bam in your face type of scent um, but you can smell it in the air and it's a, it's, it's a um, just a real light brush of scent in the air so this is what Dollar General candles I'm gonna show you guys the candles that they offer there so this one I use this one so this is an empty and you can tell guys it do burn nicely even around it's a three wick and you will find these for five dollars it's just a light since it's not sh like strong of course not this is a dollar general candle but anyway i also tried a couple of our dollar tree candles i'm just trying to try different candles because i still want to make this a more of a budget friendly type of channel too as well so i go out and i tend to try different products and if it make the cut i will review it or show you a haul on the candles but if it don't or any product if it's if it make the cut then I will show you guys but I didn't haul these candles here okay from Dollar Tree um, this was a strawberry sitting here and I like strawberry and this one was a uh, like a citrus scent but you see guys the wax is it burned great but it just, it's not even worth getting, guys. It's a dollar. And, no. This is a thumbs down. Do not even waste your dollar on it, okay? Because it just, it don't have no scent pool. Um, and it's, it smell like wax when you burn it. It just don't, it just don't have it. So, this is a no-go. So, don't go get this. But it's empty. It's trash. So that's it, guys, with my empty. So we're going to take out the trash. And, um, yeah. I'm going to take this out because it's trash day for me, guys. So I'm going to take this out and let you guys know I'm taking the trash out. Okay, come with me. So guys, we take a look at my plant. It's just so pretty. I, my daughter planted this for me about four years ago. I 
don't know what's the name of these flowers, guys. If anybody knows, could you tell me down below? Because I want to go buy some more of these. Her and her grandmother planted this for me. And these are flowers that come uh, yearly. When the weather starts to change into fall, they bloom around that time. They're just really blooming. So, yeah. I'm outside, guys. I'm taking out the trash. So, let's go. Good as trash day. So I don't know if I could do this with my hand. So thanks guys for watching and have a nice day. And like I always say and we'll continue to say guys, please rate, comment, and subscribe. And I answer to all comments. Bye guys.